a long process when a patient comes to uh, us for the when once we discuss in the multidisciplinary tumor board and then we decide this particular patient requires radiation then he will come to the radiation department then we would uh, uh, take the patient we would normally uh, do a ct scan we we'll do a pet ct scan uh, and then an mri scan and sometimes an angiogram if required and all those three scans are merged to each other and then we get a dimension tumor dimension in multiple angles and multiple uh, 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 sections what you call it as axial coronal and sagittal sections then we get a three dimensional form of the target and also the structures which are in vicinity of the tumor which will be seen uh, with the superimposition of these three scans and then we take the patient we we'll take these scans into the treatment planning which is called radiation treatment planning systems which is going to uh, uh, we have to sit there and spend 48 hours to 72 hours to design various angles and beams to reach the target and to reduce the dose to the surrounding structures so that's going to take around uh, 48 uh, 48 hours and then the entire thing what is we designed on the computer has to be have a quality assurance so we go and do it on a dummy body and execute the treatment on a dummy body and make sure what is seen in the computer is exactly happening in a body then we call the patient for the uh, treatment execution on the first day of the treatment execution of the treatment would take almost 15 to 20 minutes because we have lasers we have ct scanners we have x ray machines to verify what exactly we did it on the computer is simulating on the patient himself so on the first day it takes 15 to 20 minutes to make sure that everything is in place everything is in matching then the treatment is executed from the next day onwards as i told you it's going to be less than a minute